What if I can't make it? What if it's not meant to be? You can't really prepare for a run with a 40 odd kilogram metal box on your back. Come crashing down on me. I don't tend to think about the challenge too much as to what I'm going to go through. Because a lot of people don't realise shit it is real misery. It's not a nice place to be. What if we're all running out of time? I wanted a challenge that was was significant. You know, I wanted to do something that would really get the public's attention. And what if all this ends in glory? Now I felt that I could really demonstrate toil and struggle, pay tribute in a way to the to this to the efforts of everybody fighting cancer. And I never have to say what is. And in a way, I think running with this huge weight on my back has taught me a little bit about the human spirit. What if there's a moment? I know that the challenge is going to come to an end at some point. People who are fighting cancer, they don't know that. They don't know if they're going to beat it. They don't have anybody cheering them along. Quite the opposite. How do people react? They don't toot the horn and they don't shout, keep going. They don't give them a pat on the back. Say, you can beat it. You know, maybe we should. What if I could write the story? What if all this ends in glory? What if the moon